we're getting a lot of good looks and we just haven't really knocked them down. Um, I think that over time, it'll revert back to the mean. Three-point shooting struggles cost the Boston Celtics the game on Wednesday night against the Clippers as the Clippers prevailed with a 91-82 to point win. Now entering this contest, the Seas were down Jason Tatum and were aiming to have more consistency in this matchup. The Clippers held on to a seven-point lead at halftime, but in the fourth quarter, it was back and forth between these two teams. And the Celtics had a lot of open looks. They just didn't go down as they also struggled against the zone. We miss a lot of shots, and I thought we had a lot of open looks. Uh, we moved the ball, and we got, I know they play zone, um, but we got a lot of great, great shots, I felt. Wide open looks, and they didn't go down. Uh, we could have, you know, made some shots, but then also, like, the little stuff that we didn't execute on, transition opportunities, uh, where we got to get, take advantage of three on twos or two on ones. And we didn't, and we lost. The zone is, is doing what it is supposed to. They're trying to make us shoot threes and keep us from the paint now. Obviously, personnel dictates some of what we can do as far as that. Um, you try to find guys in the middle, which we did quite a bit, and collapse the zone, and then they'll go to man-to-man, -man, so that happened a little bit, but also getting the ball in the middle, and they're taking that away, and then you find the shooters wide open. So it's, it's hard to say what we could do better because we got wide open looks out of it. We're getting a lot of good looks, and we just haven't really knocked them down. Um, I think that over time, it'll revert back to the mean. Uh, for some reason right now, I think maybe we just have to like trust and trust is going and have that confidence. Uh, sometimes I feel like we hesitate and we overthink a shot. So um, it's one of those things where I think everyone just has to kind of play more with a little more flow, a little more freedom. And, and trust that we all trust that you're going to make that shot. It's going to go in and we're not going to hesitate. Now, Jalen Brown also said post game that it is a learning process. And he said he's not going to shy away from being a leader for this team and also trying to help inspire them. He said we need to continue to keep shooting with confidence. And he's going to reiterate that to his teammates.